Well, you can certainly feel the excitement tonight here at the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry, and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Manchester United taking on Chelsea. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Moving it forward, keeping possession of the ball with authority. Werner. Surely! Well, a tame end to a promising move. Well, he's fortunate here because the flag's gone up, but he didn't know that when he took the shot. Cristiano Ronaldo. Pogba. He's lost it. Ronaldo. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. They favoured a short one here. Teammates in the middle. Well, not the best clearance. Bruno Fernandes. McTominay. The keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Now, how about the short corner? Teammate available. But if truth be told, he made it rather straightforward for the keeper. Well, he knows it. That is a real waste of a great opportunity. Jorginho. Marcos Alonso. Using his strength to shield the ball. Bruno Fernandes and slipped through beautifully Alex Tellez it should be in it goes the opening goal in this contest Here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. And away they go again. What effect will that goal have on Chelsea? We're going to find out. Havertz. On to Werner. Jorginho. And players waiting in the centre. It is now with Jorginho. Conte. Able to get a body in the way. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Sancho. Bruno Fernandes. Sancho now. Ronaldo. He's in behind. It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident. And not giving the opposition much of a look in.
Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. Inching towards the interval, and it's going with home advantage. Stuart, as always, very keen to get your take. Well, from an attacking point of view, it's been a very good performance. I've really liked the way they've got the ball from back to front, then how the forwards have got away from their markers, and the speed of their attacks as well. It's been a really impressive first half. Paul Pogba. It's with McTominay. Bruno Fernandes. Encouraging stuff from United. He could pick out a teammate. Alex Tellez crossed accurately towards the far post. No nonsense clearance. Well, as the stats confirm, Chelsea have controlled the ball, but their attacking play hasn't been good enough so far. There's been too many safe passes and no real penetration. They certainly need to up the tempo if they're going to get back into this one. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Rashford. It's with McTominay. Diogo Dallo. Bruno Fernandes. And blocked for now. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. So underway again here, the pendulum having already swung United's way. So let's see how the second 45 plays out. Paul Pogba. Here's Ronaldo. Rashford. Throw-ins given. Well, that shouldn't really happen from a throw-in. Saved, but still a chance. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. <laughs> Favouring the short one. Diogo Dallo. Sancho. Oh, it might be. And the keeper more than equal to it. And short it is. Now it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper. Rudiger. It's with Marcos Alonso. Jorginho. Now with Havertz. Patient build up at the moment. Mount, but nothing comes of it. So a half an hour remaining. Well, let's see if something comes of this. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Mount. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Well, it still could be dangerous. Danger averted for now. 
Bruno Fernandes. Sancho now. Well, it could be on for him here. Well, the attack finally comes to nothing, and the keeper has it. Conte has lost the ball. Scott McTominay. Happy birthday to Sasha. Diogo Dallo. It's with Grand McTominay. Bruno Fernandes. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. That is really alert defending just when the situation looked dangerous. Conte. Werner. Wonderful chance. And a goal. Not over just yet. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. Well, back underway. Chelsea making this a contest. It's not in the bag just yet. Ten minutes to go. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, the referee has taken note of his name and number. Well, I think he can count himself a bit unlucky there, but it was certainly a foul. Substitution for Manchester United. Coming off the pitch, number 39, Scott McTominay. Coming onto the pitch, number 31, Nemanja Matic. And he whips it in. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. A lot of forward thrust here from Ronaldo. Now, what can he do from this excellent position? We wonder who was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. Conte. It did look on for them, but not to be. Well, United have played well today, but they've had great backing from the fans. Just listen to this noise. There will be three minutes added on at the end. Paul Pogba. Here's Ronaldo. The Red Devils have lost the ball. And the referee blows for full time. Positives for Manchester United. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes and they fully deserved their victory today. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.